Belly fats, as the name implies, refers to the excessive buildup of weight around the center or abdominal region of the body. You can shred this belly fats by trying out these workouts. Number one, burpees. First, we have burpees. Here, you stand upright with your feet shoulder distance apart. Then lower your body towards the ground and assume a low squat position. Place your hands outside your feet and slowly hop your feet back such that your chest touches the floor. Then you have to push your hands against the floor into a plank position before you jump your feet outside your hands, followed by an explosive jump into the air with your arms over your head. This exercise focuses more on your core, chest, lats, shoulders, triceps, and quads. Even more, performing burpees increases your heart rate and blood circulation, since the workout involves explosive plyometric movement. Number two, mountain climbers. To do this, you need to assume the high plank position, make sure your wrist is under your shoulders, and then tighten your core while sucking your belly button towards your spine. Then you move your right knee towards your chest and slowly take it back. Repeat the same thing for your left knee and continue the process until exhaustion. Remember, the only thing that matters is doing it right, regardless of the reps. This workout feels a lot like burpees because the main focus is on your core and other muscles. Number three, medicine ball burpees. Next up is the medicine ball burpee. You generally have to revolve the regular burpee exercise around the medicine ball. Start by extending it overhead, then slam it on the ground. Then you proceed to do it in the same way you would for a burpee, but finish it off by picking up the ball and pressing the ball overhead. That way, you extend your body even more. It functions in the same way as a burpee, but the medicine ball intensifies the workout, which is a great way to burn belly fat and build up those ab muscles. Number four, sprawls. If the medicine ball burpee seems a bit too complicated, then give sprawls a try. It's just like a burpee, but on steroids. To perform this exercise, start by standing upright with your feet at shoulder distance apart. Gradually squat and then place both your hands on the ground. Jump your feet into a plank position, then gradually lower your body to the ground. Push your body back into a plank position, then jump your feet and assume a squat again. Slowly get up and repeat the process until exhaustion. You can also burn more calories by adding a jump between each sprawl. The main focus here is to work your muscles out and burn calories simultaneously. Sprawls also help in shaping both the upper and lower body with more attention in the abs. Also, if you're liking the video, don't forget to smash that subscribe button. Number five, Russian twists. Another interesting workout is the Russian twist. While sitting upright on the floor, bend your knees and raise your feet off the ground. Then you want to hold the medicine ball with your hands at chest level. Lean backwards and straighten your spine, but hold your torso at a 45 degree angle. From here, turn your torso to the right. Take a short pause and make sure you're squeezing your right oblique muscles and then return. Repeat the same process for the left oblique muscles and make sure your movements are from the ribs and not your arm. The focus here is more on the core with a general improvement of oblique strength and definition. This exercise can be performed either with a medicine ball or plate. Number six, running on an incline. We've been talking a lot about regular type workouts, but how about something you can do on a machine? For that, I'd suggest running on an incline. Just hop on an inclined treadmill and then walk or jog for about 10 minutes before sprinting. Continue that sprint for about 5 minutes and then switch back to walking or jogging. According to statistics, running on an incline can burn about 50% more calories than running on a flat surface. Here, we have gravity to thank for that. And in other words, the downforce you experience while running on an incline increases the amount of energy needed to do the exercise. And this in turn increases your heart rate and then burns more belly fat. Number seven, rowing machine. Another machine type workout is the rowing machine. Here, you just need to get on the machine and do a sequence of timed rowing. Start at about 20 seconds of rowing and then rest for about 10 and continue on with the process. Monitor the time it takes for you to row up to 500 meters and record it. In your next session, try to beat that number. This workout helps keep your heart pumping, burning body fat and calories. It also requires a lot of strength to pull it off, which means you can build up muscles in your arms, shoulders, back, core, and legs. Number eight, strength training. Next up is the training exercise for strength. This process is pretty straightforward. Just use the heavy weights you'd normally lift with, but cut down your rest time. So let's assume that you rest normally for about one minute after 10 reps of a particular weight. To perform this exercise correctly, you are only permitted to rest for 30 seconds. This exercise increases your heart rate, burns calories faster due to the constant tension your body experiences, and it also increases your endurance level and build
builds up muscles faster. Number nine, walking. Walking is another great way of burning calories and belly fat. Sure, the process seems so simple, but a solid 40 to 60 minutes of walking a day can do wonders for your body. Just make it a hobby or even a daily routine. You'll be amazed at the results. Number 10, yoga. Another great way to lose belly fats is through yoga practice. Although this practice doesn't burn as many calories as other workouts on this list, it does help to build up muscles and endurance. Some calorie burning yoga poses include plank, chair, and wheel. In general, giving your body a daily dose of yoga puts your body in the mood for other programs. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, consider leaving a like and subscribe to the channel.